everybody it's your girl Kim and I'm back again with another video welcome to all my new subscribers what's up to the people who've been rocking and rolling with your girl from day one or if you've been here for a while thank you for always coming back also I want to give a big old <laughs> <laughs> a big old shout out to the people that's watching everything vlogs reviews hauls walkthrough sip and chat and if you're following me on instagram and using my hashtag kimball lit wicks you are my m v m v p of the channel and because of you your girl keep posting y'all let's get it started okay so now we're gonna go into the candles that I bought doubles these are the candles that I just decided to grab two of them because I just I love them I really wanted to make sure that I had at least two of these the other ones was just one and done probably so yeah okay <laughs> iced winter balsam i originally only bought one of these if you follow me on instagram you've seen that i did put this one on the warmer already and it was amazing so nice so so nice so i decided to go back to the store and grab another one because i really really enjoyed it and it was strong but it was a really really good good throw and like i said i grabbed two of them i went back for a second one okay and the um the scent notes is eucalyptus pine and balsam yeah i decided to grab two because it's amazing the throw in this small room this candle is way too much for this small room and i put it on the warmer oh my gosh the throw was probably about a nine it was so so strong i had to <laughs> i had to turn the warmer off because it was just it was really really throwing so yeah this candle is way too strong for this room in the stars grab two why i don't know <laughs> <laughs> I decided to just grab two of this is bergamot champagne water lily pink salted amber I don't know why amber would be pink and salty I don't get that part but yeah I grabbed two of these um I do have some of the body care I think I have the body care the body butter I believe in this scent so it is a nice scent so i decided to just grab the candle why not okay hopefully that's a little bit better even though i know it's a little dark but hopefully that's a little better it look a little better because of the sun it's just like all messing me up even though i love the sun but yeah okay the next two i got is the Stra strawberry sparkler was the next two I got I did originally say I was gonna get two even though I got a feeling I'm not really gonna like this candle but I had to grab two and this is from the given Tuesday collection the scent notes is strawberry Prosecco <laughs> strawberry Prosecco rose water and vanilla bean so yes 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 grabbed one of those Wow wow <laughs> and actually let me let y'all know this is my first time smelling these candles i just been really just chasing the candles for candle day so this is my first time smelling these candles and when i tell you i smell like that strawberry wine wow i don't really get the vanilla bean and what else is in here rose water rose water don't really have a well yeah i guess it does have a scent wow this is actually really strong on cold wow it actually smells like a strawberry wine cooler to me wow i'm surprised because i didn't think i was gonna like this <laughs> so yeah i got to red velvet cupcake and you see the packaging red velvet cupcake now it was it's been so much hype behind this candle 
so much hype so many people are so happy to see this candle back so yes it's back and hopefully everybody grabs some i got a feeling these candle day candles will be around so it's not like how it used to be back in the day you had to actually go to candle day in order to get some of the candle day exclusives now it's not like that <sighs> because my store seemed like they were fully fully stocked and it seemed like they were putting more candles out so chances are you probably could still get some of these candles after candle day but you ain't gonna get it for the candle day price i'm just saying so the scent notes on this is red velvet cake um cream cheese frosting and sweet vanilla yes 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 so i already know I already know that this candle is going to be going to smell like chocolate. It's going to smell like chocolate cake. Yeah, chocolate cake. Yeah, I get chocolate, but I do get like a frosting. Oh, I guess that's that cream cheese frosting. So, yeah, it is a chocolate cake with that cream cheese frost. I do smell that. Yeah, but it's not as strong as that strawberry candle. That strawberry candle... That one might be good. This one might be like a medium throw. So we shall see. Paris Cafe. And I know I said I was only going to buy one, but your girl bought two. <laughs> I end up buying two, especially since the candles is going up to the $26.50 price point, which means when they do the, um, the $10 off, these are going to be $16.50. So... I said, you know what? I better grab these now since I'm using a coupon. So, yeah. I end up grabbing two Paris Cafe candle. Roasted coffee. Sugar brochette. And vanilla cream. I think that's how you pronounce that. Yeah. I think that's how you pronounce that. So, yes. That's what it is love the packaging i feel like this is the perfect packaging for this candle because it is coffee and then for them to do it in this brown so nice love it love it love it and as you see it do have the scent notes on the front so yeah i did grab this this candle is so strong oh my goodness if you don't like coffee scented candles don't buy this one because you are not gonna like it this candle is a true true coffee scented candle so nice yeah you ain't gonna like this if you don't like coffee you're not gonna like it it's like literally walking into a cafe a coffee cafe and they're roasting coffee they're grinding coffee people drinking coffee that's the type of vibes you're gonna get with this candle and if that ain't the vibes you're looking for stand down stand down you ain't gonna like it i'm just here to tell y'all true coffee lovers this is for us this candle is for us if you don't like coffee stand down but even though i know some people don't like to drink coffee or don't like coffee but they love the scent of coffee so if you're that type of person this might be for you because this one is amazing it is so strong so strong you could sit this on the counter and just take the lid off and it will just it'll just go throughout the room this is a winner for me i was happy that they brought this back even though i do already own two but i had to grab a couple more thousand wishes thousand wishes i think i end up buying all of the candles in this whole body care collection so yeah i end up buying them all um and i think i do own the body butter in this oh the scent notes is champagne peonies and almond creme so that tells me that this is going to be that creamy champagne um yeah very floral creamy floral yeah this is oh that smells good yeah this is nice but it's kind of light it's kind of light yeah this is kind of light pink waxes y'all do see 
so yeah this one is coming off a little bit light but i did grab two because i'm not sure how long they're gonna have these body care candles who knows i'm not even sure if they ever done this before i don't know but first time in my collection so yeah grab two of those vanilla swirl brownie again i was only supposed to grab one of these candles but when i got in the store your girl just went crazy went crazy end up grabbing two and again this is just a repackage of the cookies and cream milkshake i believe it's just a repackage of that so i don't know why i grabbed two because i still have two of those candles and this is supposed to just be the same thing just renamed so yeah I might be taking one back who knows or maybe this one would throw better who knows we'll see we'll see how that work out so i grabbed two the scent notes in this one is chocolate cook chocolate cookie crumble um vanilla bean ice cream chocolate drizzle that's the scent notes so yeah grab two now these next candles i actually i actually showed these on my sipping chat when i first got them which was friday day one I did show these candles on my sipping chat. So this one is the Lavender Vanilla. Absolutely love, love, love this scent. Love it. You know, they bring this scent out in the aromatherapy. Love this scent. It's amazing, amazing. And I do believe I have a couple of these candles, but this packaging was screaming, Kim, 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 take me home please take me home so i end up grabbing them <laughs> love this packaging oh my gosh every time i pick this candle up i'm just ugh, love this packaging even though it's just a wrap around and it's that ombre mm, mm, mm. bath and body works somebody on y'all team was thinking they got me again with this one they got me again hats off to the creators that created this packaging win 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 you are winning that person need a bonus because you got me with this one i already own a couple of these candles because i love the packaging so much i end up grabbing two so yes the scent notes is lavender bloom creamy vanilla white wood and musk amazing again i showed these on my sipping chat y'all got me y'all got me i'm i'm gonna say it y'all got me <laughs> y'all y'all got me bath and body words i'm gonna go ahead and admit it i'm guilty i'm guilty yes 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 this was calling my name beautiful packaging oh my god i just love this ombre packaging and i i got pomegranate lemonade in my collection already i already got it but because the packaging was calling me i ended up grabbing two i grabbed two for what why i don't know but the packaging was calling my name even though this candle is amazing don't get me wrong this candle really, really throws good. It smells good. Nice, nice, nice candle for the summer months or spring. Super nice candle. The scent notes is pomegranate, lemon zest, and sugar. Amazing, amazing, amazing. And of course, thumbs up to the person who created this packaging. Thumbs up to you. Because I already know. Somebody looking, somebody listening. So I just want to give it back to you thumbs up to you you did your job you knew what the assignment was and you did that good job again another candle i showed on my sipping chat this t rose candle again i already own this candle but i only own one so me grabbing two more wasn't a big deal the reason why i grabbed this candle is because y'all know it was rumored that it will be a smoked vanilla rose candle that was all hype somebody lied to us we all going to the store asking for this smoked vanilla rose candle no such thing 
no such thing <laughs> so what i decided to do is to grab this candle and i'm gonna burn it along with my smoked vanilla candle and try to you know recreate that vibe that smoked vanilla rose candle so that's the reason why i grabbed two of these packaging is cute that's cute you know but it ain't nothing it ain't got nothing on the ombre packaging but it's cute mm-hmm so <laughs> the scent notes is pink rose petal white tea and dewy greens that's the scent notes when i originally got this candle i think it was last year or maybe early part of this year i don't know but when i originally got this candle it was just okay for me i'm not a huge fan of rose but i will burn rose you know um i don't own the rose and ivy or whatever the candle is called i don't own that one so to have a rose candle in my collection, why not have this one? So that's the reason why I grab it. And I will be burning this with my smoked vanilla candles. My all time favorite Bath and Body Works um, vanilla scented candle, smoked vanilla. I'm just saying, I keep on telling y'all, but some of y'all not listening. Smoked vanilla is good. Keep telling y'all, but don't nobody wanna listen to me. But when you finally do listen to me, Come back to my channel and give me my credit. Just saying. We're on to the candles that I bought three of. These are the candles that I'm like, you know what? I think I'm going to really, really love this candle. So I better grab three. So that's the reason why I got three of these candles. Because I was just guessing and saying, you know, okay. You better grab three, girl, before they sell out. So that's what I did. Um... Three of the Merry Maple Pancake. The packaging. Packaging is cute. I really like this packaging. I really, really like this packaging. And remember, on my video, I was saying, on my wish list video, I was saying that I really didn't think that I would like this candle. I always said that I was going to buy two. But I just thought that it would be just like your typical pancake candle. You get a lot of the buttery pancake. That's what I was thinking. When I smell, I already smelled it, yeah. When I smelled this yeah, candle, when oh I my goodness. Oh my goodness. I said, I gotta get three. I have to get three. So good. This is so, so good. And I was surprised and shocked because I actually didn't think that this, would can this candle would do good. I really didn't. So the scent notes in this one is, the scent notes is berries, maple syrup, um, cinnamon, sugar. That's the scent notes. Amazing candle. It is so good. Mm, mm, mm. It smells like berries and you get that buttery pancake. Oh my gosh, this is good. Mm, mm, mm. that's the reason why i grabbed three because i was like this so good i gotta have three i have to have three just in case it sell out and i can't get my hands on it at least i know i have three so now i'm fine i could be three and done but this is good and i'm just hoping 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 it throws just as good mm, mm, mm. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Bath and Body Works. Thank you for this one. This thing is good. It is good. So hopefully y'all grab this one. If you didn't grab nothing else, hopefully you grab at least one of these because this thing good. Blush Poinsettia. I grabbed three of them. One is on the warmer. But I did grab three of these. To me, this candle is nice. Let's do the scent notes before we talk about it. The scent notes is rose petal, green ivy, sweet marshmallow. Marshmallow? Okay, yeah. Marshmallow probably would make it sweet, but I personally don't smell any marshmallow. I most definitely smell maybe like a rose or something. Um, to me... I don't own that rose and ivy candle. I think, it, what is it? Rose water and ivy candle. I don't own that. A lot of people saying that this smells similar to that. To me, this smells like it could be 
pink lilac and vanilla's cousin to me it has that same soft um not necessarily baby powder but that soft rose like scent maybe i need to buy that rose water and ivy candle just to see because i know i don't really ride for rose scented candles so that's the reason why i don't own it but maybe i need to buy it just to see what's what's the hype behind it but to me this could be that pink lilac and vanilla's cousin that same family to me the same family as pink lilac and vanilla i might be saying it wrong but y'all know the one i'm talking about the one that came in that pretty jar the one that came in the collection again with all those colored jars that candle so yeah it kind of remind me of that one not i'm not saying this smells similar to that one i'm saying that this could be in that same floral family it's a soft floral scented candle more like a baby like not baby powder because to me that lila candle is very much baby powder so good it is so so good but this one most definitely could be in that same family also the lids i'm not sure what's going on with bath and body works and these doggone lids but somebody ain't on their job these lids don't fit they don't fit so as soon as you turn it upside down Liz don't fit. I'm not sure. I'm not sure what's going on with Bath and Body Works quality control department. Y'all ain't doing y'all job. Y'all not doing y'all job. We should not be having fishy lids and we should not be having lids that don't fit. These candles now is $26.50. Some of the things y'all got away with when the candles was $20 or $22. You can't do that same stuff now because now y'all asking $26.50. Y'all getting too close to the $30 price point, almost the luxury price points, to be having these problems. Lid problems. Come on. Let's get it together. Let's get it together. Okay. The next candle that surprised me, y'all. <laughs> the next candle that surprised me is this, what is this one called? This marble chocolate cupcake candle. Again, I got three. Surprised me this candle surprised me i'm just gonna say this right now i think all the candles that came in this collection hopefully y'all got them hopefully you got your hands on all of the candles that came in this collection i think i'm gonna go back and get that peach on earth candle when it first came out the throw wasn't good on that peach on earth candle but i think i'm gonna go back because to me all the candles in this collection is strong on cold that's the reason why i was so shocked and surprised by this candle i originally only got two but i went back and grabbed another one this candle is good and i don't even ride for chocolate i really don't i don't even ride for chocolate but this thing right here yes it's a winner it's a winner um the scent notes in this one is sweet cocoa milk chocolate and vanilla glaze mm, mm, mm. it's good yeah this thing good mm -hmm. to me it's giving me a coconut type of smell even though coconut might not even be in here and it could just be that milk chocolate and for me it's coming off like a coconut you know, even though it might just be the milk chocolate, but yeah, this is good. That cocoa, the milk chocolate, and the vanilla glaze. Mm, mm, mm. So good. That's the reason why I got three. That's why I got three. All of these last candles, I got three because I had high hopes for them. I had a feeling that I was going to really, really like them. And so far, so far yes the mahogany vanilla 
and the reason why i got this is because i love all of bath and body works mahogany candles normally they throw really really good so i'm just assuming this is just gonna throw just like all the other mahogany candles you know um, i just think this one is gonna be a grown vanilla just like my smoked vanilla is grown i think this mahogany is gonna be grown just like it um the scent notes in this one is warm vanilla bergamot and sandalwood so yeah i grabbed three i grabbed three because i know mahogany candles throw i love mahogany candles that's one thing about candles you have to know what you like you know it kind of saves you money in a way because we just really want to buy everything to be very honest but if you know the type of scents that you love, then you know, okay, I'm going to grab a couple of these because I know I love mahogany. I'm going to grab a couple of these because I know I love sandalwood. You know, I'm going to grab a couple of these because I know I love smoke candles. I've been burned so many times not buying the candles that I know I truly love. And when I finally burn that candle and I realize I love it, most of the time it's sold out. So learn your scent profile or whatever y'all want to call it. Learn the candles that you love and be true to your passion. Be true to the candles that you truly love and make sure you always buy those candles that you really love. Ain't nothing wrong with trying other candles. Nothing wrong with that at all. But make sure you always grab the ones you really love. So yeah, that's the reason why I got this mahogany vanilla candle because i think this is going to be grown vanilla not that kitty stuff grown stuff toasted hazelnut praline now this is the candle that i was so so excited to get i looked high and low for this thing i looked high and low for all of these candles um if you've seen those videos i looked high and low for all of these candles but this is the one that i really really want if i didn't get anything i really wanted this one um the scent notes in this one is hazelnut toasted marshmallows vanilla woods so yeah all of those scents i love i love toasted marshmallows love it i love vanilla wood love it and what's the last one hazelnut yeah i love it so i was so excited for this candle that's the reason why i grabbed three had to grab three I was so happy when I finally found it. Let's smell it. Yes. I'm most definitely getting that creaminess. But I got a feeling it's going to be a light throw. And I hope it don't. Oh my God, I'd be so heartbroken. Please, Bath and Body Works. And it looked like they all... It looked like it has the same batch code yes it looked like it has the same batch code so i'm hoping i'm hoping i'm hoping this candle throws good Ugh. this lid smells fishy this lid don't smell right mm, mm, mm. yeah the lids don't smell right it's not it ain't like that um cranberry peach candle i had that one was super fishy these got a hint of fishy fishy smell but what can we do what can we do what can we do so those were the last candles that i got that's everything that i got so online the early release i did place an order but i only got three candles i wasn't gonna get nothing but i felt like since i I, since I sat there for almost two hours, I had to order something. So I just ordered three candles. Um, Merry Mimosa, Ocean, and Endless Weekend. Those were the only three candles that I ordered. Um, I feel like I might return two of them, which is the Merry Mimosa and the Endless Weekend. Because I actually already have some Endless Weekend candles. Um, yeah. And I don't even burn them. And I've had those candles for years. Um, and I don't even burn them. Because I used to love Endless Weekend. I feel like I'm kind of burnt out on Endless Weekend. And that's the reason why I haven't 
burn those but I did order it and I might just return those and exchange them for something different. I don't know. But leave in the comments. Let me know what are the items that you got. Did you find your number one item that you had on your wish list? Leave that at the bottom. Also, leave in the comments. Let me know what do you think about the whole waiting room um, thing that Bath & Body Works did online. Did you like it? Um, were you happy and satisfied with it? Leave that in the comment. My opinion is I really didn't like it. Don't forget to subscribe. Click the thumbs up. Leave in the comments. Let me know did you get your number one items that's on your that was on your wish list. Leave that in the comments. Um, don't forget to follow your girl on Instagram. Yes, yes, yes. Hit the notification bell. And I guess I will see y'all in the next one. All right. Peace.